Ah, yes. This is Anime Talk with your boy Rogue Devil. So, yeah, um, 2024. It's been shitty for me in the beginning. In a matter of one week. Besides, you know, Cat Williams saying, You know you putting motherfucking niggas in dresses and shit. And then you trying to put my ass in a dress, nigga. Nah, thanks, nigga. Nah, nah, nah. I'm, fuck nah, nigga. I'm, I'm trying to keep my ass right and not try to get it becoming, you know, a dick rider and shit, nigga. Nah, nah, nah. You know, he's on that shit. <laughs> Another one like that is like Eddie Griffin. Well, anyways, um, I mean, the winter of 2024 anime has been just constantly. So I'll be keeping an eye on animes that I want to watch or even mainly want to watch. So I see some that had season two. But one thing I can mention is there's Blue Exorcist, the Shemaine Illuminati saga, or basically Blue Exorcist season three. Typically, I watched it the first season, but I never gotten to watch the second season because I was confused. I didn't know what was the second season, but I figured out it does have a second season, and I technically probably am not going to wa- finish it or even watch it. Um, there's a S- Classroom Elite season three. Shocking how that shit came out like last year, like in the beginning of like, f- I don't know, maybe like March. Like, season two was all. But, yeah, that that's getting a season... That already would have one episode. Um, This, Gushing Over Magical Girls. This is why sometimes I have to put on the... Cue the music. This is why I'm a degenerate nigga! I am the sin of degeneracy! I can look at it, I'm like... Very familiar to me. And to be honest, though, I was like, when I watched it the first episode, I was like, y'all niggas were wilding over fucking Redo the Healer. This anime should be the one y'all be wilding about. Anybody saying shit about this anime, nigga? I'm like, what? 21 Twitter was tweeting before it ever became my Teslas. <laughs> The X space program to Mars. And plus, I'll be smoking on that J. <sighs> Teslas. And I'm like, <sighs> gushing over magical girls had caught my interest. I was like, what the fuck is this, nigga? The way that those magical girls look. I was like, nigga, this shit is very lewd. Something's bad's going on. I had to tiptoe in there. So I watched it the first episode. I was like, damn, that's crazy what she's doing to these magical girls. And she's like a fan of them. She's like, I love these magical girls and shit. This little black cat nigga just like, what's good with you? <laughs> Who the hell is you? Oh, don't worry about me. I just wanted to. <laughs> I just need you. He turns her into a magical, evil girl. I'm thinking like Powerpuff Girl type of shit. So, you know, it's the anti-magical girl. She is apparently a very nice girl, but unfortunately, when she gets dressed up in that fucking wacky-ass outfit, then she becomes a demon. I was like, nigga, is this really an actual motherfucking... And why is nobody even saying anything about this shit? I'm like, nigga, the way she did these fucking magical girls, I'm like, hey, yo, y'all niggas want a dog and redo of a healer for its fucking slaves and rape, nigga? I'm like, to me, that's normal. But this, bro, I was like, this bitch is doing some fucking sadist activity. They said sadist, I was like, I was like oh, boy. I don't think anything can get in anime, nigga. And here's the thing. I have gone to the journey of reading manga and shit because of reading over here. It opened the gateway to the most diabolical, most fucked up shit. Here's the thing. Pump this up, nigga. If this thing is an anime, I'm telling you. I fuck with shit. <laughs> I'm telling you, nigga. If this thing is an anime, 
then we are pretty much saying anything can get anime. What's even worse, if this ever had an anime, I don't believe this would ever get an anime, but if it does, my damn. Well, we we'll probably even get to the big, the big, you know, the big thing, or, you know, the main thing that's been, we all been waiting for for the past two years. But we do have Muscle Potter Season 2. Yeah, that had a season two. I did not expect that shit to have a season two, even though, like, last, like, not this, this, the last, you know, 2023 had Muscle Harry Potter. And I was like, wow, this is a good anime. Crazy part is, is when I watched it, the whole entire fucking, all seven movies of Harry Potter. And watching it makes me wonder how Hollywood is today. I like to make men uncomfortable. Okay. Well, I don't want to. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it, no questions. But yeah, that has a season two. So um, there's another anime. Okay, okay. So there is my instant death ability is overpowered. Huh? Why does it remind me of that? That's what it reminds me of. You nigga. Technically, this nigga could just stare at somebody and just say, go kill yourself. I mean, it's not like the detective nigga who was like, kill yourself. Drown yourself. Jump off of the bridge, nigga. You don't deserve to live. Nigga, we trying to solve a case, nigga. Stop. Why are you trying to kill the victim? Bro, you killing them. Nigga. Yeah. <laughs> Is it wrong for me to... Oh, yeah, I can't even say it. I don't understand why people can't say suicide. Or, they, they have to do it like, they unfortunately deleted themselves. I'm sorry, when the fuck do I could grab me a keyboard? So, basically, when they said, instead of, it was suicide, or, unfortunately, they killed themselves, it is, they magically grabbed at a fucking keyboard, and they said, I can't live no more. They deleted themselves. Nigga! If they could delete themselves, then I could do this! Control... Is it... Is it Control Z? Bam! I brought my nigga back to life! Take that, Jesus! You see? I have your powers, nigga! I could use Control Z to bring this nigga back! You think he gonna delete himself? Hell no, nah, nigga! I don't even got the death no nigga! I got the life keyboard! Motherfucking keyboard, nigga! Control Z, he's back to life. Now what y'all gonna say? Oh my god, he's back to life. Are you Jesus? No, nigga, I'm not Jesus! Y'all better respect that nigga! Even though I hate that nigga. Don't even wanna change a motherfucking rock to bread! I was hungry when I told that nigga, Hey man, how you doing? I could give you the whole world, nigga. I really couldn't give it to him. But you gotta prove that you could turn this rock into a motherfucking bread. This nigga, Jesus, is like this. No. Bitch ass nigga. Ah! <laughs> I'm a horrible comedian. <laughs> so, back to the topic of my instant death ability is overpowered. Is this dude basically in the beginning? We see this nigga basically go and tell a bitch to go kill herself, and she died when she was putting a gun towards her, towards this woman who he was a kid at that time. And then we get on to him on a bus, and he wakes up and he's wondering where the fuck was happening. And then you got this girl. Oh my god, we're dying! Shit. And this nigga just like, huh? That's crazy. It happened. So apparently they got, apparently this whole bus got isekai to another realm. And then there's people, she, then, then this girl who pulls up, she's like, hi there. Hi there. Basically, I'm here to figure out who's going to be a hero and shit. So welcome to the world. Welcome to my world and shit. <laughs> and then the teacher's like, I don't know who you are, but you need to... Done one shot at the teacher. Then she went and go and Akai the bus driver. Bro. No! Bro. 
This girl had no hesitation. Dumb murdered the teacher. Then, <laughs> bam, killed the bus driver. And then she's like, all righty, let's continue on. So I'm going to give you this magical lesson power that will give you the ability to, to give you powers and stuff in this world. So everybody actually glows. And those that didn't glow, well, uh, tough luck. Sorry, you're, you're, uh, you're, you're an Asta. You, you don't got no powers. So, everybody got off of the bus, and for those that had no powers, fortunately their fucking friends went like, sorry, you gotta stay on this bus. He's like, bro, what you mean? I don't care, bro. You are not like us. We're, we're the special ones. You and the others, whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and trap you in this bus. So yeah, their fucking friends are the classmates left them on the bus! And you know what the main MC was doing? I don't know how this nigga did not notice. Bro, I feel like if he actually was a woke from that time, he would have just straight up told his bitch to die. And she would have did. And it would have been like, well, that's the end of the anime, I guess. Well, we couldn't do that, but continue on. <laughs> so, yeah. Like, the old anime is great. <laughs> A bit for real. Like, the anime in the beginning. Now, I will... <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Ah, the wrong way. How the wrong way to not use healing magic. Now, this caught my interest. Who's this green hair chick, bro? I was like, damn. I don't know what the hell of the anime was the premises until I watched it the first episode. We have two. We have a guy, a girl, and then we have the MC. They were all walking together home and shit. And then BAM! A magical portal opened! And then they got Isekai into another room. And I had a feeling. I was like, uh oh, that's not good. What if it's a rising of the shield hero incident? Or even worse, I don't even want to talk about this shit. <laughs> these, these niggas went through some fucked up shit. <laughs> Let me not forget about you, homie. <laughs> when the, when do you get the next chapter, nigga? It's been a while. I'm waiting. You know I'm fucking with you, nigga. <laughs> I'm waiting for it. <laughs> Wait, did it drop? No. Oh, damn. <laughs> Honorable mention. Yeah, he was an honorable mention. But anyways, yeah, they got isekai into this realm. So, um, dude touches the ball. It changed green. Both the red hair and the girl were like, Oh my god, yay! Congratulations! Wow, it's so pretty! Oh, and look at M, and M is just shook. Why? I have no clue. She gone and dragged this nigga and said, Y'all two stay here! Wow! <laughs> Went all the way to the king, the, the king, and then, and the king's like, "What is so urgent? What is the matter? Is is what is it? Is does he have dark magic? Oh, is is it that? No, this nigga got green. The cat. What did you say? Everybody in the." Everybody in that fucking room was shook. They were like, what? Wait, this nigga had green? No fucking way. Bro, the king was like, send this man. Take him away as fast as you can. I was like, what the hell is going on here? Sounds like something's bad happening. Like, bro was actually pretty nonchalant. If he had dark magic, dark magic? Ain't worried about nothing. Green? <laughs> we got some problem. And then we finally see the menace herself. AKA Rose. The menace. <laughs> Rose was like. And then she go. <laughs> a gust of wind blew in the fucking room where the king was and shit. And everybody was shitting themselves. Cause they're like. <laughs> They're like, <laughs> oh shit! So the king, you know, she's like, 
yo, what's good with you, King? How did the how did the hero summoning win? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what are you doing here? I told you to take the day off. What you talk about? I don't take no days off. You the king. Nonstop, 24-7, I'm always ready to grind for whatever the fuck you doing, king. King's like... <laughs> Um, yes, um, the hero arrangement are done super simplicity quite well. <laughs> the rogue's looking at the MC and like, like, hey, who's this nigga right here? Oh, him? That's no one. He's, um, he accidentally got brung in by mistake when we summoned him. <laughs> when we summoned the heroes, we accidentally got him. And that was true. That nigga was not supposed to be there. <laughs> so, uh, he's like, damn. Bros is like, well, if that, well, I just wanted to check up on you, King, but you know what? Whatever. So, Rose just walks away. <sighs> Everybody was like, oh, thank goodness. Oh. The king's like, oh. have a good time. Have a good day. <laughs> have a good rest of the evening, Rose Toodaloo. <laughs> and then the fucking MC couldn't shut up. So this nigga like, <laughs> anyways, um, what about my green aura? King was a cat. Her, the, the, um, the priest. Rose, what did you just say, boy? <laughs> With no hesitation, King's like, quickly, send this nigga out of the castle, quick! So the priest is like, Abacatabra, put this nigga in a bubble, water bubble, and went, psh, trying to send this nigga out of the castle. Rose, on the other hand, mm -hmm. I do like me a good fight. <laughs> <laughs> Just went and ran after this nigga. <laughs> Jumps, grabbed this nigga in the skull. Like, done punched the fucking bubble. Grabbed this nigga and said, Yo, King, this nigga's mine. I'm gonna train him. <laughs> the King's like, No, please. God, no. What have I done? Don't avoid. <laughs> And once, we will never see that nigga again. <laughs> M had to reform her. <laughs> the two, the two, that, yeah, that nigga got took. Um, I noticed that there's a couple more animes that are actually, like, there. One anime that I kind of, like, watched it that one episode, and then I just dropped it instantly. Seriously, I just couldn't. Here's the name for it. It had this guy, and I don't know. And in the beginning, I was like, oh, shit, people dying. But really, it, like like the anime, I was I was turned off by the anime. <laughs> I, I was like just not vibing with the anime, especially with the character right here. Like, bro, I'm not. No, no, bro. <laughs> I had to look up I had to go on YouTube and look up like what is this about and I was like oh it's that type of like cliche type of shit so yeah and then <laughs> um yeah finally finally the biggest entrance in the anime universe move aside JJK move aside Chainsaw Man movie with Rise out, Rose, um, bomb, double booty thing. Move out of the way. Oh, um, move out of the way, Goku, Dragon Ball Super, the second part, something. Oh, move aside, nigga. We don't need you. Move aside, any other anime that is popular. Move aside. Move aside. I have to have him for the last, the big and final entry to the anime world that came from. Manwas from Korea and shit, or Korean ja Korean mangas, d theoretically. The big MC, the, the big anime, it came out solo leveling after how many fucking years have I been watching? <laughs> Whenever the fuck, I think it was like two years ago. <laughs> but, oh. 
<laughs> Why do I sound like Bill Clinton? <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Yeah. We have solo leveling. Finally. After two fucking years. <laughs> two years have gone by. It felt like three. Personally, I think it might have been three. Uh, When did I start reading manga? Bingo. It was directly almost three years ago. Bro, like when they first said something about solo leveling, it was like three years ago. Technically, maybe two. So, solo leveling went off. It's, I mean, it's not hype at this moment. I just wanted to hype it. <laughs> yeah, I just, I just wanted to hype the anime up. I mean, preferably, I only read like 33 chapters. And yeah, that um, I mean yeah, but yeah, solo leveling is doing somewhat great. The animation is very crisp, very great. So <laughs> I think that's it. Do I have to make a part two? I don't think I want to. Ah damn it, nigga! No, I don't even want to mention. I hear pop there. I'll mention this. Actually, I'm just going to show you that I'm not even going to go into full detail with. All of this is a dead nigga <laughs> who is unwanted. That I, you're not unwanted, but I just wanted to give you some reference. But yeah, that's it. <laughs> Anime talk with your boy Rogue Devil. It just, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you would like, if you, if you, <laughs> if you like it, <laughs> Much appreciate. <laughs> it shouldn't hurt you, and it shouldn't hurt. It won't hurt you. Don't worry. I don't bite. The video ain't gonna bite you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Your boy out. <laughs>